So here, here are some rules how you can write the same polar coordinate in four different ways. So one is just like what we did. You keep the radius positive. And what do you do? If you had a negative angle, you add 2 pi, 360 to make it positive angle. If you have a positive angle, then you will subtract 2 pi, which is 360, to get the negative angle. And what else you can do is make your radius negative. If you make the radius negative, it means you go to the other side of the pole. pole. So if you have an angle here, if it's a negative radius, it's referring to the other side of the pole. Okay? So let me go ahead and show you with an example. So here I have 3 comma negative 3 pi over 4. Negative 3 pi over 4. So first find that point. So it is negative 3 pi over 4. So here's pi over 4, 2 pi over 4, 3 pi over 4, 225. And the radius is 1, 2, 3. Here's 1, 2, 3, 4. Yes. Pole. Pole. Yeah. It's the radius is the distance from the pole. Remember the center? So the other one is same radius, but now you just make your radian negative to positive or positive to negative by adding or subtracting 2 pi. That's what the first, this one meant, right? So negative 3 pi over 4 here, that was going clockwise, so now I go counterclockwise, which will be positive radian, and that is what? 5 pi over 4, isn't it? But please don't go ahead and put those marks because it looks like a circle. We write a different equation for those graphs. So any question how I got the second coordinate? which represent the same point, okay? That's what it means. Add or subtract 2 pi to go from positive to negative, negative to positive. And now the other two, I said there are four different ways to write the same point. Now we're going to do the negative radius, okay? If we put the negative radius, then it refers to the angle opposite side of the pole, so at 45. Okay, that's not the point that we are looking at, but if it says negative radius, you can use the angle opposite to it. So what's the angle of this here? It is 45, which is pi over 4. Or can you also make it negative radius? Negative, what, 7 pi over 4. So you have four different ways to write the exact same point right here. So this means what? If you make the radius negative, if you make the radius negative, then you add or subtract pi from where you are. You add pi. This is pi 180. If the radius is negative, you add or subtract pi. Yes. Yeah, so what's pi over 4? Negative what? Yeah, it's a unit circle. You need to know the unit circle. What is this? How much are you subtracting? Same as this. 2 pi minus 1, which is 8 pi minus 1, 7 pi over 4. You mean scale by 0.5? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead and try this. Name four different pairs of polar coordinates that represent S using the degree stamp. Oh. So first that, just start from all positive. So my radius is, so one, two, three, four. So that's two, two comma. And what's that angle? Positive angle going from polar axis to counterclockwise, that is 165 degrees. Now, keep the radius positive, but we're going to just go ahead and 
make the angle negative, meaning you go this way. How much would that be? 180 plus 15, so that is 195 degrees, but it's going the other direction, so it's negative. Again, please do not put any marks on the coordinate because it looks different. looks like a circle, which is totally different thing than a point. So now, what can we do? We can make the radius negative. So if you use a negative radius, it, we are referring to the opposite side of this point. So we go here now, right? So now you just got to find this angle. That is 345 degrees or negative. It's just what? Minus 15 degrees. 